These are walnut slabs, go upwards of about 15 to 16 feet long, that if you look over here, they put sticks in between all the wood so air gets in between there. So the wood will air dry anywhere from uh, eight months to a year before it gets put into the kiln and that will take another three months. And that's what it takes to dry your wood properly, make it so it doesn't warp and the wood will, will you know, hold up forever. See the custom furniture making process as you've never seen it before. Go places you've never gone before. Learn things you never knew before from Shell Meyerhoff and Zach Schulte. Experience the craftsmanship and art of true custom furniture making with our innovative designers and master artisans. At Chagrin Valley Custom Furniture takes you on the captivating journey from forest to furnishing. Here's another example of wood that's being stick dried. These look like they're about 18 to 20 footers, made for huge tables, and uh, looks like a lot of oak, uh, not oak, uh, maple. And as you see, there is a stick between each layer of slab so air can get in there and this can air dry for uh, the proper eight months to a year. If you do not air dry it properly, when you go to dry it in the kiln, you'll have it split. So that's why this has to be air dried properly, then the kiln. This is the furnace that makes all the heat for the kiln. And as you see, they're using leftover wood, scrap wood. This is the drying kiln. This is where wood is put in here from upwards of three to six months in order to get all the moisture content out of the wood. The goal is to keep a steady temperature of 140 degrees in here for like the full three months that the wood would be drying, the slabs that you would need for your table. This has got to be done perfect and each species of wood requires a different amount of time in the kiln. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. We post weekly YouTube videos like this one, so you can get the most out of your YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.